What's going on, everyone? It's RGB Tech back here again. Today, we're going to be checking out the Winlater C Mod Glib C. It's 7.1.3x version 11R2. Now, this is supposedly one of the best modified versions of Winlater Android out there because it got a lot of new customizable features such as big picture screen, animated wallpapers, gamepad configurator, a lot of DX wrappers, Turnip Drivers Box 64 version, screen effects, importing and exporting containers, and many more customizations done to it, which makes it really amazing to use. They also added updated to Box 64 build 3.1 version. All right, now simply download this package. Here I already installed this version. Now let's head over to settings. Here set box 64 version to latest 0.3.1 custom build. Here there is also a version for Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 too. Set preset to performance. Here there is a new option to enable dark mode. All right, it's fine. Shortcuts are already set. There is new big picture mode. I'll show you in this video. And there are some custom X server settings. I'll leave them to default. Gyro settings, you can also enable right stick gyro, also with some custom keys, if you connect to a compatible controller. Leave all remaining settings to default. Now save settings. All right, so this one here is screen picture option. Here we can add game shortcuts from the container. I'll show you in this video. If we go to settings, here you can customize the big screen effects. You can add background music from the YouTube, or you can import file. You can also change background wallpaper animations from here itself. All right, now let's add container. Set resolution. They also added some more resolutions. I'll go with this one. Wine is already set. If we select turnip, it shows to save the container before attempting to change the driver version. All right, select turnip driver. Also set DXVK version based on games you play. For some titles, it uses different DXVK version Enable Async. Now OK. Set audio driver to pulse audio. Select MIDI sound font version. Enable FPS meter if you want. And here there is a new option to enable full screen option. Now the screen gets directly stretched. On wine configuration. Same as usual. Set desktop theme. Set GPU name to GTX 1070 or 1080 or you can leave it to default. Set video memory to maximum. Now go to environment variables. All right, so DXVK HUD is already enabled for FPS reading. Now to advanced. Set box 64 preset to performance. Startup selection to aggressive. Everything is already set. Now save the container. You can also export container settings, which you can use it as backup. All right, now boot container. And there we go. In input controls, they added some additional options for touch screen controls. All right, now go to start. There are some settings here like D3D for VirGL Mali, VK3D, and Turnip presets, 3D tests, that we have already seen. Patch settings. Runtime libraries. Here it's important to install these things. Install both NVIDIA PhysX driver and all Visual C runtime libraries. All right, here there is input bridge option. Mostly not necessary. Some tools like 7Z, DOS emulator, and speed gear. Custom system registries. And here in programs to games, they added 3D pinball game. Windows Media Player. Of course, it's old version. Okay, all right, now let's test Direct 3D. All right, it's fine. Also go to System Tools, Wine Configuration. Set Windows 10 version to support most of the titles. Apply and OK. Now it's time to test this version. All right, now to add shortcut to big picture screen, 
You need to create game shortcut on the desktop container. It gets added. Wait a minute. I'll connect my PS4 controller to phone. Select profile. Here, as you can see, it displays my external controller. So you need to set binding, set all the control keys. All right, now everything is set. Now let's open big picture screen. And as you can see, it directly displays all the shortcuts, which I created inside the container desktop. I added GTA 5 and other two titles. Now click on play button. It directly boots the game. Remember, this is not cloud gaming. Aeroplane mode is already enabled. Your son, James. He's a good kid. He's a good kid? A, a good kid? Why? Does he help the fucking poor? No. He sits on his ass all day, smoking dope and jerking off while he plays that fucking game. If that's our standard for goodness, then no wonder this country's screwed. And what about you? What about me? Hey. I don't have the advantages that kid has. By the time I was his age, I'd already been in prison twice. The end of the road! With a big house and a useless kid, and I'm stuck talking. In the same way, you can add more number of game shortcuts to the big screen, which you can directly access easily. And it's user friendly. Anyways, that's all for this video, guys. Hope you liked. Also, subscribe us for more. Thank you, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.